Hello everyone, welcome to Cyberbase Uncut, the show where I forget it exists because, I don't know, even though it's easy to just record a video and upload it with no editing. So I was going to make a normal video on this, but, you know, I'm, I'm taking a bit of a break. Um, I mean, I might make like a short or something, but um, I just want to make this video because I want to get these out there. So these are not Dash Beyblades, they are just upgrades to some old designs. We got Dragon and we got Spriggan. Um, so, uh, yeah, we're just gonna talk about them very briefly, do some battles, um, because, I don't know, didn't really think these guys were, uh, worth just making a full review on, but if you want to see full reviews, they are there, they're just kind of outdated, but, anyway, so here is the new dragon, I guess we'll start with him, so, uh, for the blade itself, it still has the sliding blade, similar to Gatling, um, the shape is the same. It has uh, the teeth now more outwards. And there's also a clear under the chip, which I think looks kind of cool. Or not the chip, but just where the chip would be, because actual dragon chips are clear. And then some other design changes, some color changes. The bottom is a full square, which gives it more burst distance, because now the blade doesn't rock back and forth. Um, so overall, just a pretty good upgrade. It also is more structurally stable. So we have these one by one brackets right here. Then these inverted one by one brackets right here. And these just help out with the stability because originally these contacts, this whole thing was held together by two studs and that's really bad. So um, yeah, upgraded blade, pretty cool. Uh, next up we got a 1A dash, pretty much the same as it was before. It's just now, you know, just cleaner, only has two colors, no mismatch brackets and whatnot. And then spark is exactly the same as it was before, so. Overall, a pretty good upgrade to the old dragon, um, and uh, I think it's pretty good. So moving on, we have Spriggan, a very cool dual spin Beyblade. It does have different parts. It has a chip, it has a ring, it has the support, and then it has the tip. The tip is the same, just getting that out of the way. Um, the chip, also the same, as you can see. Uh, there's tape on here because sometimes this piece likes to come off because this is a fake trans red 2x4. I was going to replace it with four real transred 1x2s, so just like that, but I don't really have enough pieces, but I'll get them later. Um, the support, because this is like the least interesting part. When you put it onto the Beyblade itself now, it looks more like a chassis, which I thought was kind of cool, um, but that's about it for that. For the ring, um, we have, these are now those half square, half round tiles right here, which just keep this putty on better. Also, many of the studs are now squares, which you can probably see, and... The right spin mode is a lot cooler. We have a lot more clear. The black is also a little bit more emphasized. Um, the top design now has these teeth instead of those grill pieces. And I think it just looks so much better. It is quite busy. Um, but I, in, in this case, I don't think it's a bad thing. It does look a lot like a Legend Spriggan. Where is the tip? There it is. I'm looking, I'm looking at the stadium through my uh, camera right now. So I'm kind of disoriented. But... Um, yeah, that's it for the spray. It actually looks really nice while spinning, too. So we're just going to do a couple test battles, not too many. Um, we'll do a battle with Spriggan in right spin attack mode. Um, also, uh, just, just to mention, um, the right spin mode is also shorter, which helps out with attack. And then, you know, you'll see the uh, left spin mode is also taller. So, you know, just, just a little, just a little neat little thing, I guess. I don't know. Good shoot. All right, let's see. Dragon is pretty good in the stadium for a little a little while. I thought he was bad, but I don't know. I think I think it was just bad matchups. But yeah, you can see them all spinning. They both look really nice. I mean, I think Spriggan. Ooh, big hit. I think Spriggan does look a little bit better while spinning, but you know, Dragon's still not bad. All right, so that's one zero there. Let's do another battle and right spin because let's be honest, Dragon's probably gonna win again. Uh, we'll launch Dragon first. This one goes shoot. Goes shoot. Even though it has an attack tip, I still feel like it has... Whoa! Oh my... <laughs> Wait. Oh my gosh. That was sick. The counter. Dude, this works? Th wow. <laughs> I, I was believing... I always believed that um, merge was bad. But dude, that was the coolest thing I think I've ever seen this Beyblade do. Okay, okay. We'll count that as one point because I want to do one more battle. We'll launch Dragon again first. You know, just because. Right, three, two, one, go shoot, and go shoot. All right, let's move on. Oh, wait, it was spinning. It started spinning there. It started to still spin. Oh, whatever. We'll just switch it to left spin now, just because. 
All right, so there we go. And you can see it's a little bit taller because now this is flush with the bottom. If you saw in right spin mode, it wasn't. So yeah, let's switch the launcher. The height doesn't really change anything. It's just kind of like, just the way I built it, that's what ended up happening, which I don't think is bad. Three, two, one, go shoot. Three, two, one, go shoot. All right, let's go. Oh, and they're gone. They are gone. Oh, it's awakening. It's awakening. It's not really an awaken. I mean, I guess by definition it is, but it's kind of more like a Gatling dragon type gimmick. Um, not like Imperial dragon, really, because it's sliding. Not really. It's not very mechanical. Go shoot. Go shoot. All right, let's go. And let's see. It's Oh, and it just gets kicked out of the stadium and it knocks into my tripod. Very cool. Very cool. So yeah, both of these Beyblades, um, they're pretty good. That's why I didn't really make dash versions of them, because I feel like their designs weren't outdated, but they just needed a little bit of tweaking. You know what I mean? Um, and also, Spriggan did get a weight buff, so, you know, this this better performance is definitely making a lot more sense. And Dragon wins that. Okay. All right, so that's kind of it. I, I could battle them against other Beyblades. Actually, let's do... Let's battle them against... Um, I come on, try them against Wizard Arrow. Wizard Arrow is just such a cool Beyblade. Um, so yeah, we have some... Actually, hold on. I think I battled Dragon against this guy in the Wizard Arrow review, but I don't remember. Like, I genuinely don't. All right, let's see. This gets kicked out. Whatever, that's fine. Because Wizard Arrow is still very good. It's just that Dragon is like 33 grams. And I did weigh Spriggan. Spriggan is around... Um, like 31 grams it's in like the high 31s to the point where it might as well just be 32 but you know it is a little bit small and it has a it's fused with the chassis so you know it makes sense but that's still really good weight it's heavier than freaking cyber which is very funny and it wins that one all right cool we'll do one more battle but we will put spriggan in attack mode so just to show off the height difference here you can see it's nice and flush then we switch the parts around. And now you can see that, yeah, the chip bulges out. And now this is like a little bit lower. I got to switch my launcher too. But um, yeah, overall, I really like these upgrades. They definitely make them look a little better. They're, in Dragon's case, it's a bit more stable. In Spriggan's case, the right spin mode no longer looks like a dumpster fire. Wow. Wow, the attack mode actually kind of works for attack. Okay, maybe I'll do like a Sour Bay's Uncut testing this thing out. But um, yeah, that's about it. Overall, uh, I like these things. They're very well-deserved upgrades. And uh, yeah, uh, comment, like, subscribe, stuff like that. And I'll see you in the next video.